Hey guys, it's story time with Brandon Brody, and I'm gonna tell you the story about the time I punched a priest on Halloween. When I was in college, me and my friends decided to go out for Halloween, and we went out in Baltimore City. I went to Towson University, we decided to go to Baltimore. This particular Halloween, I was Tyrone Biggums from Chappelle Show, so I decided to dress as a crackhead. I had the, the khaki outfit on, I had the red hat. I even, <laughs> I even put blackface on myself, which is kind of disrespectful because some people thought I was a white dude in blackface. Nonetheless, keep moving forward. We go out to Halloween, people are all out in the streets. You know, it's a popular road in uh, Baltimore where everyone just kind of walks and goes into the different bars and whatnot. And at some point during the night, my friends and I were just watching all these white girls pass by. And then we, no matter what they had on, we would just say, oh my God, it's Britney Spears. Oh my God, Britney Spears. And they would get pissed. I was like, no, I'm not. I'm a princess mermaid or whatever. We didn't care what they were like. Oh my God, great Britney Spears. Just ruining however much time they put into their costume or whatever the case may be. So then there was another white guy. He was about this tall. He started walking by and he wanted us to say something to him. He was like trying to incite it. We weren't messing with white dudes. We were just messing with the white girls that were out there. So he's walking and looking at us and he looks at me and he says to me, you're a fucking crackhead. And I'm, yeah, it's accurate. I was Tyrone Biggums. I was dressed as a crackhead. But somehow I heard the N word in there. I don't know where it was, but somehow he slipped it in there. So he gets, so he gets closer and I'm like, what'd you say? In Tyrone Biggums' voice. The whole time I was like, what'd you say? Like this is in, in character. And he said, you're a fucking crackhead. And I said, responded to him because he was dressed as a priest. I said, and you touch kids for a living. This dude, comes over to me and says, what do you say? He gets in my face and everything. And I said, and you touch kids for a living. He shoves me off the shove. I punched this dude and I dropped him like immediately. I've never dropped anyone in my life. Felt kind of good. Not gonna lie. Didn't know I was even capable of that. All right. So when he gets up, he's pissed. My friends and I walk away and we go, we go off and you know, just, just get away from this situation because I didn't want to get arrested. Now, mind you, a little bit later, his friends end up meeting up with me. They find me and they surround me. I'm talking about bigger white dude there, another white dude there, another white guy here. They surround me and they're like, yo, we heard you hit my friend. And I'm like, oh man, I'm about to get jumped now just because of I hit this priest. Now I'm about to get jumped by the Catholic ministry. I don't know what's about to happen. So, so they surround me, but then my boys come and surround them. So you have this, this like this circumference. You have like a, a it's like, it's, I don't know what kind of cookie or like dessert it would be, but it was like a chocolate filling with white icing and then chocolate, it was a ho-ho. We basically made a ho-ho. It was like chocolate, vanilla, chocolate, right? And so I'm standing there, I'm not giving up. I'm still Tyrone Biggums, but I was like, you know what? I'm gonna scare these dudes. And so I saw, for whatever reason, I saw this other Baltimore dude, like clearly, I don't know if it was his Halloween costume or he was just, that thug of a dude, but he had the sideways braids and he was going into his car. And I said to them, yo, y'all might want to chill right now because my man's is right there and he got a piece in the car. He got a strap. I didn't know this guy. I just saw a trustworthy, untrustworthy black gentleman in Baltimore that probably had a strap. So when they saw that, they said, you, your friend needs to apologize to my friend. Ap hold on, ap I just dropped your friend and all the, you guys surrounded me to get an apology? So I said, oh, I'm sorry for dropping your friend on the ground. And I guess they, they accepted my apology and they dispersed. The worst part about the night is that my hand kept continuing to swell up because I didn't know how to throw them hands. I threw a terrible hand and my hand kept swollen. So I had to go into Subway and ask them for ice and they didn't have anything to put it in. So I literally took a sandwich bag from Subway, put ice in it, and I was icing my hand all night as Tyrone Biggums. And that's the story about the time I punched a priest on Halloween.